What's good with y'all, man? So listen, I want to talk about something that's not talked about a lot when it comes to female nature. So something that's not talked about is a woman's possessiveness, her possessive nature that has to do with the overall female nature. So what you guys got to understand is, and this is why, guys, if there was a time for me to emphasize getting on your fucking grind, this is it right here. This is it. This is what a lot of you guys want. You want women vying for your attention. You want women chasing you. You want women trying to lock you down. But I'm going to tell you something. The guys that get that shit, they understand. That's when it turns into a problem. That's when the women become a headache. I said this before, but there is no hate with women. Guys, on this side, there is no hate with women. The problem is, first off, the problem is the guys that don't want to level up. The guys that don't want to, the guys that come up with excuses and don't want to do nothing for themselves, the guys that do not want to level up. Your problem is yourself. As soon as you get over that, as soon as you overcome that hump, as soon as you blow past that obstacle, yourself, your ego, honest truth, the sky is the limit. But like I said, the women, hating the women is not the problem. That's not the problem for guys like us. That is not the issue. The issue is getting annoyed with them. The issue is them not respecting your time and blowing you up at times it's inconvenient for you. Trying to see you when you know you need to be on your grind. And they know they should understand because you let them know. But they still move past that. They act on their emotions, right? And it's not like we don't expect them to act on their emotions. They just act on it in their time. And they want to see you or link up with you. And you're like, nah, I'm busy. And then you let them know that. And then they get frustrated. And then they feelings about that shit. Then it comes, you know, th that's when it becomes a problem. Because that's that's when it becomes an annoyance. You know what I'm saying? That's when it becomes a headache. And you don't want to deal with that shit. That's the only issue that arises with women. When you are a high value man. And you understand your leadership role. And you own your shit. All right, you don't hate women. There is no need to hate women. Let's get into the side. A lot of guys do not talk about red pill people, whatever the hell it is. They don't talk about what it's like to be on that side where you are a high value male. You get the options, right? You get the women that you want. What it becomes is you picking and choosing the women that you want to deal with, the women that you want to give your time to. All right, because that's the level you want to be at. For you guys that's sitting here like, yo, I can't wait to get to that. I can't wait to. You will get there. Stay focused. Stay focused. And you will get there. I'm telling you, you will get there. But once you reach that echelon, once you reach that level, you will have no problems. Except the one I mentioned. But overall, you are moving how you want to move. That's how you want to do it. That's the whole point, right? That's that's where you guys want to get. Okay, I'm getting, I'm picking and choosing what I want. Now, don't think that it's just, oh, well, I literally just step out of my house and all these bitches love me. Now, they will find you attractive, but it's up to you when you talk to them. It's up to you when you get their number. It's up to you when you're with them to maintain the frame, to maintain all the things that you learn and maneuver in a way to seduce them to get what you want and you keep them coming back. You keep them coming back for more, right? This is the level you want to be at, right? This is the side, like, like a lot of guys talk about, like a lot of the red pill community guys, let's, let's get real. A lot of guys like to sit here and complain. That's not how it's supposed to be. That's not how it's supposed to be. We know we want to figure out our passion. We know we want to level up. Move in a way where you accumulating all the wealth. You getting the money. You getting the opportunities. Abundance is flowing in your life. That's when you become a high value male. That's what you want to seek, right? But when you reach that point, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, for you guys, it's not at this level. This is all the motivation for you. This is all the motivation you need. When you reach that point, women, they're going to start vying for you. 
They're looking at you. They're trying to lock you down. A lot of you guys don't understand what that means, right? Because this is what y'all got to understand. When you go out with a woman, like you don't even, my bad, you don't even got to go out with her. Do you know how many women I meet out? I'm going to just talk about it, just a recent thing that happens, and it happens all the time. I just don't talk about it. But I was like, you know what? This will bring a different twist. This will bring some value to you guys that's on your shit. Because the guys that's really on their stuff, they understand this. And the guys that are looking to, you know, level up to that point are still trying to figure out how to get to that point. This is all the motivation you need. Girls want to own you. They want to own you. That's no joke. It's no bullshit. They claim, they want to claim ownership of you. I was out just the other night. It's not even tonight. Okay, I could talk about forever, every single night I go out, all the times of this kind of stuff happening. But I'm going to just bring this one situation up. I was out last night, seeing an older woman that I had met before I messed with. And she's like, you know, she's with her girls. It's one of her girls' birthdays. She's like, oh, hey, this is my friend introducing me to them, right? And they're like, oh, he's so fine and blah, 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 blah. I just let him ramble on. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Right? Because the girl that I already messed with, she got a fat ass and, you know, she know how to throw that shit. I'm cool with that. Older woman, good pussy, great. But her friends, one of her friends was bad too. Wasn't the birthday girl, but one of her friends was bad too. So she's telling me, yo, do you know any, you got any friends out here or whatever? We was at a spot. I went out solo. She was like, you got a friend, you know, my friend's birthday. They trying to, you know, get some dick tonight, this and that. For those of you guys that don't know, that's how women are. When a woman's able to break their guard down and really tell you, like, be real with you, that's how it is. My friend over here, it's her birthday night, all them looking for some dick. And you know me, I'm like, what's up? Introduce me to your friend or whatever. I was look, I was already looking at the other one, right? Not the birthday girl, but the other friend. Attractive, light skin, curly hair. That's my type. Ass, that's my type. Right, it was already the one chick that I had messed with, but her friend, I'm like, oh, this is something new. New things attract us. The high value men had already fucked some shit. We like, okay, on to the next one. I want to hit your friend, right? But this girl right here, she was like, nah, I don't want to share. She says she doesn't want to share. That's the point. They don't want to share you. When you become that high value guy, when you become that dude that has the options, when you focus on your grind, that's what fucking happens. So if you think this is a game, think again. It's not a game. Stay on your grind. If you slacking, you lacking on your game, stay on your grind. Stay on it. I'm telling you, these women want you. They want a guy that knows he's a man and respects himself stays at that stature and lets women know that. They respect that. I don't care what shit test is thrown at you. I don't care whatever the hell it is. When you understand the overall piece of the game, when you understand the overall piece of how you need to move as a man, you get the options, you get the women and they respect you. And guess what? They want to own you. But like I said before, She's not the only one that wants to be the only one.